Whether you're building a mobile app that needs to connect to Nextcloud, you want to integrate an independent web app, or building a dedicated Nextcloud app, our APIs are nicely documented for you. As you might recall, last year, we introduced the ability to build apps and languages beyond PHP. This uses our OCS API, and we made several SDKs available to simplify the work for developers. Not only does this allow you to pick your favorite language, but apps using this framework can't interfere with other apps in Nextcloud. We can maintain stable APIs and the admin can distribute resources running heavy services on a different server with appropriate hardware. Last but not least, this all brings security benefits as well. With this release come some new features for external apps. First, we have created a way for these apps to define a settings screen for admins or users using a declarative syntax. Second, we made it possible to inject a full user interface into Nextcloud. There is already menu integration and files, modification support and a chatbot API. Apps can now have some significant integration capabilities and we are always working on more. Next, the administrators will appreciate it we brought our AI integration to the new external app framework, making it possible to run these various AI features on separate servers. Last but not least, if you're the developer of an external app in our contributor ecosystem, you can now use our TransFX to get help from our awesome translation community. We want to help you to get started building apps, so we wrote two new tutorials. First, a hello world for app developers to get started easier than ever before. And second, we introduce a tutorial for using GitHub Codespaces as a development environment. You can find these and many other tutorials if you go to our nextcloud.com slash developer. The best place to get started building apps for Nextcloud. And then, when you finally created your app and released the new version, it's important to tell the users what you changed, new features, bug fixes, enhancements, and more. In Hub 8, users will receive timely notifications about app updates, ensuring they stay informed about your changes. Of course, not every user will already know your app. So we also introduced the new discovery section in the App Store. This will help administrators discover your application, hopefully bring it to a much bigger audience. Of course, there's always a lot more going on into the next cloud developer ecosystem. We have been improving our app store steadily over the last month. And we now add the ability to users to report comments as spam. And for PHP app developers, we introduced a new routing mechanism, which simplifies the code. If you're a developer, please don't hesitate to share your feedback on where we should focus our effort to improve your experience even further. We look forward to the apps you develop. I want to say again that this would not have been possible without our amazing community. Thank you for making Nextcloud what it is. And if you too want to get involved, you can check out our website and find out how.